Hey guys, how's it going? We're on my Demonology Warlock. And, you know, we're, we're gonna win this battleground, I believe in myself. Anyway, uh, this video I'm gonna be talking about why I don't really like Demonology, but I'll still play it when people request it. Um, main reason for Demonology is that, or why I don't like it, is because the cast times that you have to get off, and I think we have like one or two instant cast spells. Counting Shadow Flame, obviously, but not Dark Lair and not, um, whatever. Demotic Empowerment has a cast time. What else is the cast time? Um, Call Dread Stalker usually does if you're not Honor spec into it or Honor Talented into it. Um, Yannigul Dan has a cast time. Uh, Demotic Empowerment has a cast time. Um, summon Dark Glare. It actually doesn't have a cast time. Thought it did. That's awkward that my pet's just kind of sitting there doing nothing. But anyway, the reason I don't like Demonology is because way too many cast times for my liking. Um, seems like all I really do is cast, and then when I do actually get some casts off, it seems like my damage isn't that great compared to what the other Warlock specs are capable of. So, right here I basically have a ton of pets up. We'll see how fast this guy dies. Um, okay, that did nothing. Terrific. We'll do... I'm totally fucking up here. Okay. Please die. So let's see. I have like every cooldown popped. Not every cooldown, but most of my offensives popped. And I'm not doing much here. Alright, well, I really didn't accomplish anything there. Um, it seems like Demonology kind of hits like a wet noodle, too. Our most damaging ability is our main pet, which is, I'm pretty sure, this guy. So. Our fucking fell guard is hitting more than us, which is always a good sign that a spec is in the right place right now. When the pet hits for more than, you know, you actually do, but, and uh, you guys will argue that, you know, that's what demonology is supposed to do. It's based around your pets, but I don't think it should be that way. I think it should just be like, you pop cooldowns, you do damage. I'm just going to see how long. Oh, okay. Well, that was a good interrupt. I'm still going to pop this on you. Let's see if I can even pull this off. A 1v1 against a Frost DK. Doesn't seem like it. This is one you know you gotta balance spec. Help me, team. Thank you for saving my ass because this spec is kind of garbage. Um, I really don't like this spec. When I, so many cast times, uh, the, like even if you don't take Master Summoner, you can take Call Fell Lord, which is good at better 1v1s because it does damage and it will stun people when they're near you but let's go over everything that has a cast time right now artifact weapon uh hand of doom okay this guy's gonna shit on me let's see if draining life even does anything send fucking help please This is so good. Wow, what a good spec. But anyway, why I don't like Demonology. So many cast times, very, very poor 1v1 potential. Uh, even if you get focused by another caster, most of the time you'll just get shit on. Unless you really know what you're doing or have a lot of artifacts power invested into your thing. Um, I feel like all the talent choices are fairly bad compared to the other talent choices that the other specs have. Uh, obviously, the top row talent... Really didn't expect Shadow Flame to be the best, but sadly it is. Um, improved Dread Stalkers, calls two Wild Imps, causes. This literally gets rid of some of your damage and causes it to do 80,000 Shadow damage to people around you, which doesn't make sense to me because then you're getting rid of kind of your main kind of damage generator, which is your Wild Imps, which is kind of what the whole build is built around, but you do you, Blizzard. Um, this 
reduces the damage fucking time of Doom. Mortal Coil feels like the only viable option here just for the heal because you always need it in a 1v1 and you always need the Horrify, otherwise you just kind of get trained by someone and that fucking sucks. Um, so going over cast times again, or at least all the cast times that we do have. So we have Demonic Empowerment, Shadow Bolt, uh, Call Dread Stalkers if you're not, PvP, Talent Inspect into it, Hand of Doom, Falcules, Consumption, Fear, um, basically every single one of our abilities that isn't, I guess, Doom, and Dark Glare, and Shadow Word Flame, or whatever it's called, is a cast time. I don't even know why I'm using that. What's my pet doing? There he is. And this guy's just bugged out. He's not even doing his fucking job. He's actually not getting cast off, which I absolutely adore, because he's trying his best. I don't know, that bug's been here for a while, I'm not sure if Blizzard really knows about it or not. So, whenever someone asks me what the worst caster spec is, you, I used to say like Fire Mage, or anything that's like, not a Warlock. Now I can just easily say it's, it's definitely Demonology, because Demonology seems like complete garbage to me. This guy still isn't doing his fucking job, and the thing is, all the other talents below here I really don't think are that great. Maybe I just won't use this guy anymore, but he does so much damage if you actually get him to use his brain and actually do what he needs to do. Okay. This video is going to get so many dislikes because all I'm doing is ranting about how Demonology is the worst Warlock spec there is out there, but that's my opinion. You guys are entitled to yours, but that's just mine. I don't think people understand that what I say isn't like God's word. Because apparently everyone takes it that way for some reason. Okay, I'm actually getting damage out now. This is surprising. Okay, let's watch a turnaround. Oh, well, never mind. Just took half my damage, half my health and damage while I just stood there. Because cast times. And everyone's gonna compare this to. I don't know, whenever I compare this to other Warlock specs like Affliction, you have Agony Instant, uh, Corruption Instant, Unstable Affliction, which is like our one and only cast time, really. Phantom Singularity is an instant cast, and uh, Siphon Life is an instant cast. What else is an instant cast? Um, I can just like go to the abilities right now. Agony's instant cast, corruption instant cast, uh, Drain Souls channeled, but I still count it as instant cast, I guess. Um, I feel like the only spells that are really not instant cast is Affliction are, what's it called? Unstable Affliction, Drain Soul, and I think that's it, really. I mean, there's, well, Drain, Drain Life is Drain Soul, so. Um, please don't shit on me. Okay, thank you. Yeah, so I just have to be in constant fear of melee when you're a Demonology Warlock, because if a melee decides to go on you, you're just going to die. That's kind of how it works, unless you have Summon Fell Lord and can manage to pull Jesus out of your ass. Um, it's it's Demonology, man. It's not. I don't. It's never been good, this whole expansion, from what I'm aware of. If you're a really good, like, 3v3, or, like, fucking... What's that one Warlock's name? Um, Asian... Um, that really narrows it down, doesn't it? Fuck, I can't think of his name. Anyway, he went to like a lot of tournaments, from what I think. I'm using not using Dark Lair because it's just bugged right now and it's not doing its job, so I don't really see a point in using it. Let's see if it actually gets the cast off. Now it does. That's very odd. When it does actually get the damage off, it's fucking amazing. But it's not for some reason. Um, <laughs> talking about demonology. Okay, comparing it to the other specs now too. Uh, destruction. Destruction has a long casted nuke, which would, if you don't know, chaos bolt hits for about 1.5 million, about as hard as the Thalkiel's consumption. Uh, lining that up perfectly. Um, what else do we have? 
Incinerate, which has a low cast time in my opinion, and you don't really use in PvP. You have Immolate, which has about a 1.3 second cast time and generates embers enough for you to just spam Chaos Bolt if you apply that to everyone. Uh, you have Conflagrate, which is your instant cast hits for about 200k to 400k and generates, I think, 4 embers or something like that, which is obviously good. And let's see if this guy does his job. He's still not doing his job. Come on, man. I trusted you, and you failed me. Boy, I sure do love fucking Frosty, guys. Okay. Um, what else does destruction have? Rain of Fire is even an instant cast now. I'm just gonna go to the spell book, see if I can name off a few spells. Really, the only spells you have: Incinerate, Emulate, Fire, Fire spells, more Fire spells. Um. I feel like for the amount of spells that Demonology has and all the cast times that we do have, it's just, it's just really not that great. Especially with your bug, with your pet bugging out every second to the point where it just sits there and doesn't do damage and is the most viable bottom row talent that there is right now. In my opinion, that's what people have told me. And yeah, I, I just don't like Demonology, but I will play it to the best of my ability, but I just don't think it's as viable as the other two specs, even closely. Um, just so many cast times for very little damage. And then meanwhile, you can just go destruction hit for like 1.5 million constantly, and it's just amazing. And like, there's no problems with that spec whatsoever. <sighs> the only good thing about Demonology is that you can just get a shit ton of cast off. It does a dick ton amount of damage, but the chance of you actually doing that, very, very little, I'd say. Okay. So that's my rant about Demonology and why I don't like it. The amount of cast time it has, just, it's too much for what you're asking for it to do, which is just a shit ton of damage that the other two specs can do very, very easily. Come on, man. Half the time you don't even work. No, whatever. There we go. Okay, that's that's not worth it. Is it though? I could just like It's kind of just hitting like a target dummy, so may as well. Let's see the damage here. Okay. Uh, yeah, the amount of damage that we just like have to pull off with the cast time we have. Let's see. Let's see what our most damaging ability is right now. Right now, it's our fell guard. So, there's a sign of a very good class design. Um, I guess it's not horrible, technically, because you are just... I mean, your fell guard is supposed to do a lot of damage, but... Let's go back to damage, please. Okay. He should die. Oh my god. How are you still alive? Okay. So, our fell guard has done 25% of our damage. Um, Shadow Bolt, which is our... Shadow Bolt, Doom, and Hand of Gul'dan, which is our self-damaging spells, I'd say, have done, quick math, 25% of our damage. So, Shadow Flame actually didn't even count that. Add another, what, 34% of our damage is from ourselves. The rest of them is from pets. And even then, when your pets do hit people, there's the possibility of them bugging out, the AI not working, um, the pathing being wrong. It seems like you're just too dependent on cast times and your pets for this to be 
as viable as the other specs. I'm not saying it's not viable. If you really want to get good at demonology, you can and can make it viable. I've seen plenty of people do it. Um, I'm just saying, if you're looking for a spec that you just want to play easily and can easily play and d do fine with and not really think a whole lot about min-maxing your pets and all that shit, um, I would just suggest playing Destruction or Affliction. I really don't see any point in playing Demonology other than the fact that of the class fantasy of having a ton of pets running around you, there's really not much it offers over the other two specs. Um, yeah, sorry about the negative video, but you guys wanted me to play Demonology and I figured I'd give you my thoughts on it. Um, if you guys liked the video, give it a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. Uh, if you guys have any questions, comments, tips, concerns, anything like that, feel free to debate me in the comment section below too and why you think Demonology is a better spec than I am saying it is. Um, I'm always open to those kind of topics as long as you just aren't a complete asshole because uh, I don't think anyone really likes those. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.